Hey there, Claudia St. John with Affinity HR Group. We are your HR partner and resource. I got a call earlier in the week and it's such a familiar call, I thought I would share it with you all. So um, this company, it's pretty small. There's maybe 15, 20 employees, very little turnover, a pretty older workforce. The average workforce age is probably in the mid 50s. And now they're bringing in new talent, which they're super excited about, but it's causing some intergenerational conflict. And the point of conflict, like the big point that gets everybody hung up, is the cell phone use. Um, older managers, senior managers, they want those cell phones put away and checked and put in the drawer, not brought into work. And so they'd like a policy for that. Yeah, we can develop a policy for that. But really, this generation is so intermodal in terms of how they communicate. They are constant communicators. Asking them to alter their natural form of communication is a really bad idea. Um, if you take away their phone, it's gonna cause them stress. They're not gonna be able to be in the contact that they need to be in with, with friends, with family. And, and really, it, that assumes, the assumption that they have their phone means that they are not being productive. Well, in fact, if you take their phone away from them, I'm not quite sure it's gonna improve productivity anyway. My best advice is deal with it. Let them know what appropriate social media use is in the workplace, but base their, base their your assessment on them, not based on whether they showed up or are running through the hall with a stack of folders in their hands, or if they're sitting on their phone. If they're getting the work done and they're doing it well, and they're satisfying your performance objectives, my best advice, get over it. Cell phones are here to stay and they're not going anywhere. I hope this was helpful. Probably not what you wanted to hear, but it's probably what you needed to hear. Take care. Bye.